Welcome to our channel Pharmacotherapy Made Easy. In our previous video, we have discussed about child pug score, parameters that are present in child pug score and how to calculate it. Now in this video, we are going to estimate child pug score using an example. A patient of age 69 years, male, have been admitted in the hospital. The parameters of child pug score were as follows. Ascites was mild to moderate, albumin was 2.4, bilirubin that is total bilirubin was 8.2, patient was having hepatic encephalopathy in mild to moderate range with symptoms of delirium and other symptoms etc. Patient's prothrombin time was 20.3, patient's INR was 1.78. So now we will assign scores based on these parameters, then we will add up, add that is sum up the scores and calculate the child pug score. For ascites, since it is moderate, the score assigned will be 2, albumin is 2.4, so score assigned will be 2, bilirubin is 8.2, so score assigned will be 3, hepatic encephalopathy is mild to moderate, score assigned will be 2, prothrombin time is 20.3, so score assigned will be 3, INR is 1.78 and score assigned will be 2. Now we will sum up all these scores, ascites 2 plus albumin score. We are, we are summing up scores, not the values. We are summing up the scores. Aside score is 2, plus albumin score is 2, 2 plus 2, 4, plus bilirubin 3, 4 plus 3, 7. 7 plus 2 of hepatic encephalopathy, 9. 9 plus 3, 12. 12 plus 2, 14. So total score is 14. So as per child pug criteria, if the score is 10 to 15 in range, patient comes under child pug class C and dose, dose of many drugs should be reduced by 50% for this type of patients and hope this example makes you clear how to calculate child pug score. Thank you.